Hey, how you going? Just thought I'd um, show you how much water fell out here. There's still heaps of water on the road. Um, it's pretty good though, so far so good. But yeah, check this out. Wolfy Shack. It's beautiful out here. How nice is that, eh? Heaps of water. Check out this tank. Mm. Nothing ever really goes to plan, does it? No. No, that's right, yeah. We got close, but we didn't quite make it to where we wanted to go. There's a massive big wash that runs for miles up here, and our turn off <laughs> was just on the other side of it, and it's like full of water. There was no way we were going to get through it. Um, and uh, we just turned, we were going to do a U-turn and as we were doing a U-turn we noticed this sort of really old track, you could probably just make it out here, um, running up the side of it, so on the other side, so we thought we'll just keep, we're just going to have a look for gold along the side here and then um, we're going to just keep driving up uh, until we get sort of close to our target zone, I mean that's all we can do, and then um, thank god we got the bike with us. Um, and yeah, just go out on the bike. It's the only way you can get around when it's like this, so onwards. Um, and it looks like um, a bit of a contact zone here. Uh, you're going to see the change in ground and the colour. So it's as good a spot as any to look for gold. We did see a little bit of old timers trash uh, as we were coming in, and I've drilled along here, so. Yeah, it's as good a spot as any to look at. There's an old peg here on the ground. Um, but no recent activity, nothing, so... Yeah, we'll give it a crack, see what happens. I'd like to find gold here, because it's a nice spot. And we could just park up here for a few days. This is how you know other people have been prospecting around here. Because they leave their shit everywhere. Looks like fairly... Yeah, we old actually. Hmm. It's another one over there. Must have been camped right up about where we parked. There was a few scrapes around, but old. Golden, highly doubtful. <laughs> Went clunk though, didn't it? And you know what? <laughs> it's a bloody bit of gold. Frick me. <laughs> That's unbelievable. Yeah. yeah, it's a little dirty. Very nice. Oh, thank goodness for that. Gold though. Yep. Pretty quickly. Yeah, like three steps. Well, it's where you said it was. It's exactly where I said it was, but unfortunately, people have already been here. Well, it's better than half a gram. It's almost a gram. Oh, very good. It's fantastic. $80. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'd like to get more excited, but unfortunately, it's been cleaned out. You can see the scrapes here. And, um, 
That was right on the surface, but they're running exactly like I said up along here. Um, and you can see where they've done all their scrapes. They're pretty old though. Yeah, very old. And um, it's all coming out of this um, contact zone through here. So I thought, I mean, the only thing we can do is just see if they've missed anything. Has just come straight out. Um, this one's probably going to go next. Unbelievable. So the fix was the bush fix um, was a big, um, a big bolt, pretty much that we had like a ten peg. Only I'll screw in pegs, and uh, that should hold it. Look at the holy What the hell? <laughs> Look at this! Look at this! What a bloody oasis! Alrighty, I've been wandering. I've got a target here. It's, uh, it's not strong. Sounds very good actually. So we came um, probably two kilometers up the line here. We just see the car parked over on the side of the ridge there we're quite high up which is pretty annoying actually because it's bloody windy as hell today anyway I was just following this foliation here they've drilled through here and it looks like it looks like honestly maybe one other group of people have prospected through here Oh, you know, in the last bloody 50 years. <laughs> promising. Very promising. That's going to be gold. Just got that sound about it. Sounds fantastic. I knew it had to be around here somewhere. Ground here is very nice. Looks like, you know, perfect for gold. And it's quite a large area, so you could easily just miss it. You know, that got it. Jeez, I'll turn my back to the wind because it's just. That's a bloody good chance to be a bit of gold, eh? What do you reckon? Very good chance. Come on. Yes. Oh, it is. Yes. That's a good bit. That's a gram. Hell yeah. Rough too. But yeah. 
Look at that little sharp little piece. It, it'd have to weigh over a gram, I reckon. Yeah. Was 0.8. Yeah. Well, it might be close. Looks chunkier. It does look chunkier. It'd probably be like probably a gram. Oh, one and a half. Yeah, yeah, nice. So we're half covered the cost. Yeah, <laughs> we're almost there. How nice is it out here? Right now. It's gold. <laughs> yeah, we're just back at um, Eagle's Nest Patch because uh, we couldn't find any gold uh, down at the other spot we camped out, and we we're only like a kilometre away from here. We found gold here a couple of years ago, so I thought we'd just come back uh, before we go home. And uh, I had didn't have the 17 by 13 here last time, so I thought I'd run it back over. I'm not sure if I got a target here or not. Sounds like it's picking up on something a bit deeper. Plus, um, we've had heaps of rain come through in the last um, month. I think it's like something like 400 mils or something in some places. So you can see the ground's still a bit wet here. <clears throat> so yeah, it could just be ground noise as well. Could just be hot rocks. This place was hard to detect because there was a lot of hot rocks, and now the ground's wet, it's just extra hard. So, I'm actually, not expecting to find anything here. It's making an interesting noise, though. <coughs> Sounded like it got a bit stronger then. I thought there would have been more deeper gold here. We only found really small bits up the sin. Yeah, nothing. Oh, I lie. I wonder if it's not just a really small bit of gold that the 14 didn't pick up on or it could just be that hot rock actually that I shit on my scoop it's been windy as hell the last few days too I'll take my scoop back in the bike good lord Definitely something there, not a hot rock. There's only gold here. We didn't find much trash. I'd be shocked if it's a bit of gold. Oh, it'd help if I could. I was like, it'd help if I could find it.
has to be a little bit I think it is <laughs> well, it's actually not a bad bit deeper and you know what that coil is doing its job that coil is doing its job there you go we absolutely smashed this place smashed it to bits and uh, the only thing that's changed is this coil and a heap of water that's run over that's not a bad bit i'm pretty happy with that actually i don't think i was going to find any gold today so <sighs> another beer i think so wow okay just go slow and hopefully you can get another one but it's been uh slim pickings this time around anyway keep going That. Oh, that's a good piece. It's probably the, the biggest piece that we found in that area. They were all tiny. Tiny. Remember, you killed it over there because yeah, you had the six, yeah. and you absolutely. I mean, they're only tiny nuggets, really sharp ones too. Um, oh, that's a surprise because you know we yeah. went over it. Like. Well, I said that we'd gone over this spot so many times. The only thing that had changed was the fact that I got the 17 by 13 coil on. Yeah. It's probably not a bad guess. A little, little chunk though. I'm gonna be optimistic and say like 0.75. <laughs> hey! Broke a gram there. Well, I didn't think that'd be a gram, you know. Yeah, well, that's alright then. So that'll make it over three. Oh, wow. Over three? Oh, that's just amazing. Three and a half. <laughs> Shit. Pretty good considering how pretty hard going it was. It's pretty sad, to be honest. Better than nothing. Three little tiny nuggets. Holy crap. All from a diff all from different areas. That's how hard it was. Unbelievable. Three and a half, that's good. Covers your cost <sighs> Another day, another fifty cents. Oh, we forgot to weigh your god. Oh wait. <laughs> Honey ha ha. <laughs>